welcome esteemed members of the Papatard fan base. Welcome to another epic video. Yeah. So what we're going to be looking at today is something that I find as a very, very interesting topic is we're going to be looking at the top five masks that you're going to wear to Walmart during quarantine. And so basically the way I'm going to decide the top five is simple. So basically we have different tiers. We have, you know, they have the uh, durability of it. How likely this type of mask is to like break down under pressure. We have style points. How cool you're going to look wearing it. And we have actual like use, which is like breathability and like whether or not, you know, like the vaccine, like the germs will even get in your mouth. Because we don't want none of that Corona, you know what I'm saying? All right, guys, so let's get into the Fortnite mask. So first of all, we got the durability on the mask. You know, this mask is very durable, you know, solid 10 out of 10 there. For the style, you're going to get another solid 10 out of 10. Nothing beats the Fortnite mask when you're in a Walmart. But sadly, for the practicality, I'm going to have to give it a 2 because you're going to die of a virus if you wear this thing. All right, so next up we have the tortilla mask. So let me just start by saying this thing has a bonus factor of having the edibility. So you know you're sitting there surviving. This thing is edible. You are sitting there in the line for Walmart. You can take a quick snack out of your bite. But okay, so let's get into the scale. So for durability, I'm gonna give it a solid three. You know, it's not as strong as the plastic Fortnite mask, but it's gonna tear apart pretty easy. But if you're not like touching with it or fidgeting, you, it might survive. So I'm gonna give it a three there. For style, I have to give him the 10 out of 10. Who was coming into Walmart rocking the tortilla? Come on now. And then for practicality, I'm actually going to have to give it a 10 also. Because, tell me what kind of virus. Virus is it's named after a Mexican beer. Come on now. Alright guys, so for this next mask, we have the pot lid. Oh yeah, I got this straight off the bowl of macaroni. Um, so this lid is very good. As you can see, the durability, solid freaking 15 out of 10. Nothing is getting through that bad boy. It has the, the see-through glass and everything. Nothing is penetrating that. For style, I'm going to give it a solid 9. You know, it's not as stylish as a Fortnite mask or a tortilla, but it gets the job done. And then for uh, practicality, it has to get another 10 out of 10. No virus is breaking down that impenetrable hunk of glass. You know what I'm saying, Zan? Alright guys, so for the last mask we're going to be reviewing during this video, uh, we're going to be looking at the plastic bag, the plastic food for less bag. Now you can really use any company you want. Uh, I just chose food for less because that's where my mom goes grocery shopping. Um, the must I say about this, uh, you know, you can see it has very, it's very see-through, that's pretty good for you. Um, so some benefits, you got the durability. That's a solid, it's a solid 10 out of 10 because, you know, no one's going to be like tearing through that easily. You know, it's not very easily worn down it's not as strong as the, the glass but still and then for the style i'm gonna give you a solid a solid a solid nine just like the pot because you know you're you're not you're nine like come on it's not as cool as fortnite mask but for the for the practicality i'm gonna have to give it a 20 out of 10 my guy like seriously you are you're sucking all the oxygen out of that mask like you only have a couple a little bit of oxygen in there you think that the the virus wants to go where there's no nowhere to breathe? You're just gonna die if you use the mask. So that's why I give that a 20 out of 10 for practicality. If you've made it this far, you probably want to know about some cool things the subscribers can do, and that means we're gonna be having a a Fortnite fashion show, a Fortnite fashion show with the subs, and there's gonna be a little cash prize. So so stay tuned on that. 